Let's go over how to pull ears during a uh, head massage. So the ear is a really good connective point between the head, the jaw, and the back of the head. So it's a wonderful release of tension. You don't want to use your forefingers. It's too, it's too pincery. This is a massage technique, which is fine. What you want to do is engage the entire ear. So hopefully you have big enough hands like I do. And um, gather the side of the ears on the basin of your thumb, as well as the side of your thumbs and go in a direction that is towards the table, but also diagonal as well. It helps to release uh, the fascia and the connective tissue that surrounds it in a nice slow manner. And you're not yanking, you're taking a nice and slow release towards the basin. This is wonderful for tension headaches and for um, ringing of the ears, um, as well as um, dizziness. It helps to center. And again, you're going to pull towards the table. See how um, my th uh, basin of my thumb is literally pulling away as you let go. Another good point to pull, actually, is uh, the tragus point, which is right in front of the ears as well. And you're going to just hook your thumb right in the crevice, and you're going to feel a crevice. It's, it's uh, a little hollow dent joint there. And again, um, this one is more towards horizontal as opposed to downward towards the neck. And going to pull slightly, much less pressure than the ear. It's, it's a small divot of area, so it's not gonna be as significant. And again, this is wonderful for um, tinnitus, dizzy, dizziness, um, ringing of the ears, and um, actually really good point for sinus as well. And that's how you pull ears as part of the head massage. Mm -hmm.